Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to local music and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and we're once again back in the downtown Las Vegas Arts District at Local Hotspot Taverna Costera for another songwriter showcase hosted by Hal Savar. It's always a great time seeing old and new musician friends at these things, and this time was no different. With some showcase regulars and some faces we haven't seen in a while, this one promised to be a fun one. Now then, where did I leave my keys? Found them! To the Room 6 Mobile! This video is brought to you by Stand Up To Cancer. We'll hear more about them later. For now, let's get on to today's video. A great place for local art and artists to show off their wares, Taverna Costera is also known as a place where the food is great, the signature cocktails are delicious, and the staff and atmosphere are amazing. You owe it to yourself to drop by Taverna Costera if you get the chance. If you'd like to be featured on a future showcase, contact Hal Savar using his social media handle that I've put down in the description. That's also where you'll find the social media handles for every act mentioned in this video. If you'd like to be featured on Room 6, hit me up using my email address or the Room 6 social media link down below as well. While you're down there, feel free to like, share, and subscribe to help me grow the channel and its support of the local music scene. Thanks! Opening up the show once again was Fabian de Armas and his keyboard. Combining piano playing with his own brand of crooning, Fabian warmed up the growing crowd with songs of love and loss and everything in between. His songs are mellow and did a great job setting the mood for the rest of the night. Asking Fabian to stick around, Quinn Turner stepped on stage next. This wasn't the first time we'd heard these two together, and it was nice to watch them complement each other's musical styles once again. Fabian did a great job listening and playing just what the songs needed as Quinn poured out tales of loss and life. The addition of Fabian's instrumentation added another layer to Quinn's music in a great way, and I hope they do something more substantial together soon. Next up was Alexis Ryan, an incredible young songwriter blowing us all away on the regular. With heartfelt lyrics and songs full of emotional content, Alexis did a wonderful job of stirring up memories in many of us. Reminiscent of bands like Hole and the Cranberries one moment and Led Zeppelin the next, her lilting vocals wafted over everyone and lulled us into a dreamlike trance. Stepping up to possibly break that trance was longtime showcase regular David Wax. Starting his set with a song that released that day called Tortured, David proceeded to put on a clinic for the youngins on how to tell stories and take listeners on a journey with your music. He also unveiled a new song, so follow him online to find out when that gets released as well. Next up was Caroline Tronoski, another showcase regular quickly making a name for herself. Caroline's music is just like her, sweet and soulful and full of light and love. That being said, she's not afraid to write about heartbreak too. Having seen her very first performance in front of a crowd in the past, it's been a real pleasure to watch her blossom both as a songwriter and a stage presence. Make sure you check out her music soon. A face we haven't seen in a while on stage, Carl John was next. Throughout his life and music career, Carl has been many things and gone through many things too. Channeling these experiences into his music, it's easy to see that songwriting is an outlet for him. We're so glad he graced our showcase stage and hope to see more of him in the near future. Another face we haven't seen in a while, Spencer Hinton was up next. Immediately blowing everyone away, Spencer managed to walk that tightrope of manic energy and impressive musicality. Not afraid to throw some discordance into songwriting, every song was different than the last, yet all of them fit together and were quintessentially Spencer. Spencer also sings for the band Kook and plays in the band Elevated Underground. You owe it to yourself to catch Spencer live if you get the chance. Keeping the theme of haven't seen them in a while going, Mitchell Kane was next. Utilizing a backing track, Mitchell's music is basically a biography and a cautionary tale. Drawing inspiration from mistakes in his past, Mitchell is a great example of it's never too late. He was a great example for all of us to never give up on being creative and pursuing your musical dreams. And now, a word from our sponsors. Thanks, Josh, from the past. Generally, I'm an easygoing guy with love for most people and things. But you know what I really hate? Fucking cancer. Like many of you, it's affected my family too, and it really needs to go. In fact, there will be 5,200 people diagnosed with cancer today alone. That's why I'm partnering with Stand Up To Cancer. Stand Up To Cancer funds and develops the newest and most promising cancer treatments to help patients today 
They dramatically accelerate the rate of new discoveries by connecting top scientists in unprecedented collaborations to create breakthroughs. Their innovations lead to better cancer prevention, diagnoses, and treatment, which means that we can help save lives now. They're committed to funding ambitious and robust research and awareness efforts focused on incorporating health equity in cancer care for the benefit of all patients facing cancer. The best part? 100% of your donations support Stand Up to Cancer and its collaborative cancer research programs. Just for watching this video, and for being part of Room 6, and for a limited time, you can use my affiliate link down in the description to get 10% off your first order when you sign up for email. Plus, you'll be helping out the channel and the cancer fight. Thanks to Stand Up for Cancer for being a sponsor, and let's get back to the show. Next up was Sufi, a duo that likes to keep things chill. Bringing island vibes to the night, Sufi and her guitarist Chris Hayes brought the evening back to how it started, creating a mellow atmosphere full of love for all. I'd love to hear them with a full band, so fingers crossed, we'll get treated to that someday. In the meantime, make sure you check out this talented duo and all the acts mentioned in this video. You'll be glad you did. Finishing things off was our host, Hal Savar, playing his new song, Back to You, to send us all home with a smile. It was a great way to polish off a great night of music. Overall, the latest installment of the Taverna Costera Songwriter Showcase, hosted by Hal Savar, went great. I sincerely can't wait for the next one on Thursday, March 28th, and I hope we'll see you there as well. If you can't make it in person, hop on the live stream. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope that we'll see you at the next Songwriter Showcase on March 28th at 6 p.m. at Taverna Costera. If not in person, then on the live stream. Speaking of live streams, I have linked the live stream for this one that I just reviewed down in the uh, description. What else? Oh yeah, special news for those of you that have stayed to the end of the video. Thank you, you the real ones. I have, if you're interested in this, I have my first ever all heavy metal showcase happening Saturday, March 30th at the new local music venue, Sinwave. It's on Main Street um, in the Arts District. It's gonna be awesome. We got Annalita, Pariah was one, um, Short Fuse, Raya, and Head Gore. And it's just going to be a whole bunch of different genres of metal represented that have all been on my channel. So if you want to come to that, go to room6.shop. Ticket, Pre-sale tickets are only $6.66 because metal, <laughs> plus tax, and or they're $10 at the door. Either way, it's a great value for five amazing bands. They're each going to play for 45 minutes. There's merch. It's, it's going to be a great time. And because it's the day before Easter, Sinwave and I have gotten together, and if you find an Easter egg hidden around the venue, free drink! So, hope to see you there. Hope to see you at Taverna on Thursday, March 28th, and what else? Oh yeah, remember to be amazing. If you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. If you want to subscribe, click up there. Don't forget to ring the bell. And if you want to hear my own music, click over there. Remember to be amazing, like I said, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.